Hi LEGO fans, it's Sunday the 17th of December and day 17 of our LEGO Advent Calendar door opening spectacular! Every day between now and Christmas Eve, we're opening up every door on every LEGO Advent Calendar including LEGO Friends, LEGO City and LEGO Star Wars. We're also building all 24 models from set number 40253, the 2017 LEGO Christmas build up. Yesterday's builds range from the sublime to the ridiculous, the ridiculous LEGO City race car and the sublime director Krennic's Imperial Shuttle and I want to thank William Townsend and MBT8 Railfan12 for pointing out it was director Krennic's Imperial Shuttle and not Kylo Ren's Command Shuttle. They let anybody upload videos to YouTube and we don't always know what we're talking about. So without further ado let's start breaking open those door number 17s. So for day 17 of our Lego Advent Calendar Spectacular we're starting off with the Star Wars Advent Calendar and behind door number 17 is a minifigure. We've got one of the um, one of the guys from the Death Star. Uh, it looks like one of our admirals. Although I don't know the insignia, but always great to get these Lego Star Wars minifigures, and that is a very nice one. Here's the assembled minifigure from the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar. Now we weren't able to find a specific name for this minifigure, so we're gonna call it the Generic Imperial Officer. But he does have a scar on his face there, so maybe we've missed something there. I'm sure you'll let us know in the comments down below. He's a very nicely printed minifigure and always a joy to get these from the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar. He's wearing these plain gray pants, but a nicely printed uniform torso. That's got some metallic printing on there, as you can see, and a little bit of detailing on the back. He's also got this Imperial hat with, again, a little bit of metallic printing with the Imperial logo. So this is a very nice minifigure. He also comes with a blaster, which of course all Imperial officers are obliged to carry. And he's an all round nice thing and he's gonna take some beating today. Next, we've got the Lego City Advent Calendar. So let's see what's behind door number 17 today. <laughs> tricky to get into these really is tricky and uh oh that's very nice we've got a little uh, helicopter build um yeah not the most convincing helicopter in the world but uh, not a bad little build so yeah we'll put that together and give her a little look here's a completed helicopter build from the lego city advent calendar and they are most definitely continuing their aviation theme we've already had two airplanes and now a helicopter just to round it off now this is a very nice thing. It's not a huge build, but we've got about 12 Lego elements in here. And um, yeah, I like the color scheme. Uh, it would have been nice to have had a clear windshield on this, but all in all, it's a recognizable helicopter and that's about all we can ask for. So here is today's toy helicopter from the Lego City Advent Calendar. Our final Advent Calendar for today is the Lego Friends Calendar. And behind door number 17, I can barely contain the excitement we have. Hopefully not another fireplace. Oh, right, okay, uh, so we've got, um, <laughs> no idea what that is. Uh, that looks like some kind of market stall. Again, we've got the uh, the festive wreath on there, but um, yeah, I don't know what it is. Um, <laughs> let's, let's build it anyway. And uh, hopefully you guys can tell us in the comments down below what this is actually meant to be. I also forgot that yesterday we got the delightful cat and the fish and I believe this is going to work with the cat. So this is actually going to be a cat scratching post. This or something like that. So the cat can use this little ramp here to climb up and then it can sit on here and look very pretty with its Christmas wreath. So um, yeah, kind of um, almost pointless, but it's something to sit the cat on. Hopefully we'll get something to sit the fish on tomorrow. And finally, it's time for build number 17 of the LEGO Christmas build-up set. It doesn't look like we're getting a very big build today, but we've got quite a high part count. So let's get this put together and see what we've got. The LEGO Christmas build-up is perfectly on brief today. We've got a very pretty and festive candelabra. This is a very nice thing. Uh, we've got this circle down there. We've got some decorative elements. And then we've got the four candles complete with flames. He uses a bit of imagination, of course, but that's a perfectly nice thing and a really nice gift from the LEGO Christmas build-up set. 
So a pretty good selection of gifts today with festively themed builds from the LEGO Friends Advent Calendar and from the LEGO Christmas Build-Up and not so festive gifts from LEGO Star Wars and LEGO City. But which one's your Sunday success story and which one needs a ride on the Polar Express to remind them about the magic of Christmas? Was it the very colourful but somewhat pointless cat scratching post from the LEGO Friends Advent Calendar? The festively themed Christmas candelabra from the LEGO Christmas Build-Up? Did the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar own this day yet again? gain for another cool minifigure? Or perhaps you're an aviation fan and you appreciated this helicopter build from the LEGO City Advent Calendar. Should they stay or should they go? Be sure to let us know in the comments below. So thanks for joining me for today's LEGO Advent Calendar door opening spectacular. I can't believe there are only seven days until Christmas Eve. And that means we've only got seven doors on each Advent Calendar. If you enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more awesome LEGO content. I'll be coming back at you with another video bright and early Monday morning, and I hope to see you on the 18th of December.